Keep your dreams alive. Understand to achieve anything requires faith and belief in yourself, vision, hard work, determination, and dedication. Believe all things are possible for those who believe. I'm Linda Watson Call. I'm so glad you could join me for today's episode of Dragonfly Soup. Today's episode is called The Price of Success, but success is one of those things like happiness, peace, love that you just can't buy. Now you could pay me to coach you on skills that you need to improve on to become successful, but the key words here are you need to improve on. Now, I know parents who purchased what they thought was success for their child in the form of false grades to get them into a prestigious college. That wasn't success. That was manipulation of the system and a form of bribery. I also know of college and even high school students who paid someone to take a test for them. Oh, they got the good grade, but that wasn't success either. Success is very personal and has to come from within. It comes from your passion about something that you want to do, something that you feel you need to do. Success never finds excuses for not doing it. Success finds ways to make it happen. I ran across an article last week about a young woman named Wren Blay. The story started with Wren completing a clean jumping course. No poles were knocked down, and her riding was flawless. Well, that's what we expect at horse shows, right? We gasp whenever a pole drops or we see an error on the part of the rider. There are a lot of things that the audience didn't know about Wren, though. Wren went from never having ridden, let alone jumping a horse, to successfully competing in a schooling show in three years. Phenomenal, right? By all standards, yes. Oh, but there's one more thing. Wren is legally blind. Think about that for a minute. A person who is blind learns to ride a horse and successfully jump a horse in the span of three years. You know, like many young girls, Wren always loved horses, but there was no extra money for her to ride and take lessons when she was growing up. So that goal for her as it happens for so many of us, was pushed back. It was a, someday I'll be able to do this goal. As a teenager, she had been diagnosed with a rare form of juvenile macular degeneration, but she continued on with her schoolwork and other activities. She completed college, and she received her bachelor's degree with honors. As her vision deteriorated, though, she realized that she had a goal that she might not be able to achieve if she didn't attempt to do it right now. That goal was to learn to ride and jump a horse. She started at a therapeutic riding center and learned to ride. As her riding skills improved, she told her instructor that she wanted to learn how to jump. Her instructor told her that no matter how good of a rider she would become, because of her vision, she would never be able to jump a horse. Well, Wren was determined that she would be able to jump and went from trainer to trainer, only to hear variations of the same answer, no jumping. Now, you and I would probably have given up and settled for riding on the flat and call it good, but not Wren. She finally did find a trainer who could teach her how to jump a horse and was able to devise a way for her to learn a jump course. If you're not familiar with jumping, the rider usually walks the jump course, figures out how many steps the horse needs to take between jumps, and then decides the best way to navigate the horse. For most riders, the process of learning a jump course is under an hour. For Wren, learning each course takes several hours. Wren's trainer had to come up with a way for Wren to know where she was in the course, as well as how to navigate it with her limited vision. 
Wren's determination brings to mind a quote I know from a three-time Olympic gold medalist and a five-time Olympian, Gail Devers. Keep your dreams alive. Understand to achieve anything requires faith and belief in yourself, vision, hard work, determination, and dedication. Remember, all things are possible for those who believe. The ability to jump and compete is a dream come true for Wren. But her story isn't over now. Her new goal is to make it to the USEF show jumping ranking list and compete in the 2024 Olympics. This would make her the first blind jumper to compete at this level. After I read Wren's story, I had to think, how hard am I working to achieve my goals? How much dedication and determination do I have? And most importantly, do I really believe that I can and will achieve my goals? How about you? Look at the goals that you set in January. Are you closer to achieving any of them? What can you change in your life or lifestyle to make it happen? Share in the comments below or in an email what you are going to do differently to achieve your goal. I've also included a link to Wren's website if you would like to read more about her, her dreams, and how you can support her. And don't forget to click like for this week's episode. Be sure to share it with your friends. And I'll see you next week right here on Dragonfly Soup. Here's to our transformation and our best year ever. What if you could get anything you want in life? You know you can. Whatever you want, a better job, a vacation home, your own business, it's all within your reach, no matter what your current situation is. I know because I did it. As a divorced mother, I knew the odds were against me. 20% of all divorced women fall into poverty. 25% lose their health insurance, and 75% of divorced mothers don't get their full child support. I learned the principles of manifestation shortly after the divorce, and within a few years, I was making more money than my ex-husband, was able to build my dream home in the country, complete with horses, and I transformed my writing ability into a successful multimedia development company. I am willing to share with you the techniques I've learned. They are all in my book, Living an Abundant Life. Each chapter of this book explains a method that I used and shows you how you can achieve your goals using that principle. Living Abundant Life is available on Amazon, but if you click the link below and order the paperback version through my bookstore, I'll send you an autographed copy, no extra charge. Start creating your dream today. You have the power, and this book will show you how.